Welcome or welcome back to the series where we're going to be testing out top rated face masks sold on Amazon. Today we have the Daddy's Choice Purism. It comes in a pack of 20. Pretty small box. These are KN95 made in China. The standard of this one is GB2626-2019 KN95. These come packed five per bag. Let's go over the listing really quick before I try it on. They're the Purism KN95 face mask, disposable 20 pack. They are a five layer face mask. They are currently a 4.4 out of 5 rating with over 15,000 reviews. That's a lot of reviews. They're on sale for $14.99 which makes them 75 cents per face mask. The reseller is Amazon. So let's go ahead and try one on. This is how they look. On the mask itself, it is contain anything other than the KN95 logo. Let's pull these. I don't think it's gonna, I don't think it's gonna snap. This is how it looks from the inside. The material from the inside, it's not the softest. So these fit pretty big on my face, but I don't know if it's because I was yanking these straps. So let me try a different one on. Let's see. Okay. Yeah, I did kind of loosen these up a little bit. This one fits a lot better. The wire is pretty good, so it is it is providing a good seal. What I am noticing though, it has a lot of collapse, and they're just a little bit harder to breathe than other than other K95s. Nope, I don't smell anything. So with all that being said and giving you guys my opinion on how it fits my face, let's go ahead and see how it performs with our TSI machine. This is our TSI machine. We use it to test the particle filtration efficiency of a respirator or mask. Our testing procedure is inspired by NIOSH. We first remove the headband from the mask before placing it onto the testing plate to ensure a proper seal. Then we make sure that the mask is completely sealed with hot glue to the testing plate. The testing plate is then attached to the frame and the box is placed under the TSI filter holder for testing. We will be testing three masks to acquire the most accurate information. Let's go over the results. F stands for airflow rate, which we test at 85 liters per minute. R is for resistance, also referred to as pressure drop. This correlates with the breathability, so the lower the number, the more comfortable and breathable the face mask is. E stands for filtration efficiency percentage. As shown, the filtration efficiency percentage for all three masks was 98.80% or higher. We're back now and all three face masks that we tested passed, which is really good when it comes to the filtration efficiency. As I mentioned earlier, whenever I was giving you guys my opinions, I did feel like I was struggling a little bit to breathe. The breathability wasn't the best. And also according to our pressure drop results, they are a little higher than most K95s or N95s. I was struggling to breathe, so the comfort wasn't the best when it comes to that. So I'd probably give that a seven out of 10. The construction quality of these are pretty standard. Like I, like I said, I kept on pulling these straps. They're not coming off. The nose wire is also a pretty decent nose wire. It's not too flimsy, but it's also not too hard for you to adjust it to your face. I really hope you guys guys found this video helpful please don't forget to give us a thumbs up subscribe to our channel and also don't forget to click that bell notification to get notified every time we upload a new video please be sure to leave in the comments down below any face mask or n95 respirator that you like for us to test out next and finally don't forget to check that description box down below we will have a lot of information including our master data sheet and uh, website which is acumed.com and i'll see you guys in our next video